Hello everyone welcome back to my channel. On a recent webinar organized by the Iraq Britain Business Council, IBBC, two renowned experts in the field of Iraqi economics delved into the intricacies of the Iraqi dinar exchange rate. Professor Frank Gunter of Lehigh University and Dr. Ahmed Tebachli of AFC Iraq Fund, who is also an expert blogger on Iraq business news, shared their insights on the various factors influencing the value of the Iraqi dinar. Their discussion covered a wide range of topics, providing a comprehensive analysis of the economic, political, and social elements that affect the currency's stability and fluctuations. Professor Frank Gunter began the webinar by outlining the fundamental economic principles that underpin the exchange rate of any currency. He explained that the value of the Iraqi dinar is primarily influenced by supply and demand dynamics within the foreign exchange markets. Gunter emphasized that Iraq's heavy reliance on oil exports plays a crucial role in determining the supply of foreign currency, which in turn affects the dinar's exchange rate. He noted that fluctuations in global oil prices can lead to significant changes in Iraq's revenue from oil exports, thereby impacting the country's foreign exchange reserves and the dinar's value. Dr. Ahmed Teb actually expanded on Gunter's points by discussing the specific economic challenges faced by Iraq. He highlighted the country's ongoing struggle with political instability, corruption, and security issues all of which contribute to economic uncertainty. Teb actually pointed out that these factors can deter foreign investment and reduce investor confidence, leading to decreased demand for the Iraqi dinar. Furthermore, he explained that the government's monetary policies, including decisions on interest rates and foreign exchange interventions, play a pivotal role in managing the exchange rate. The discussion also touched on the impact of external factors, such as international economic conditions and geopolitical developments. On the Iraqi dinar, Professor Gunder explained that global economic trends, such as inflation rates and interest rates in major economies, can influence investor behavior and capital flows, thereby affecting the dinar's exchange rate. Additionally, he noted that geopolitical tensions in the Middle East, including conflicts and diplomatic relations, can create volatility in the currency markets and affect Iraq's economic stability. Dr. Teb actually provided an in-depth analysis of the structural issues within the Iraqi economy that hinder its growth and stability. He discussed the importance of diversifying Iraq's economy beyond oil exports to reduce its vulnerability to external shocks. Teb actually argued that investing in other sectors, such as agriculture, manufacturing, and services, could help create a more resilient economy and stabilize the dinar. He also emphasized the need for comprehensive economic reforms to address corruption, improve governance, and enhance the business environment in Iraq. The webinar concluded with a QA session, where both experts addressed questions from the audience. They provided further insights into the short term and long term prospects for the Iraqi dinar and offered recommendations for policymakers. Professor Gunder and Dr. Teb actually agreed that while there are significant challenges facing the Iraqi economy, there are also opportunities for growth and development. They stressed the importance of implementing sound economic policies and fostering a stable political environment to support the dinar's value and promote sustainable economic growth in Iraq. In summary, the IBBC webinar featuring Professor Frank Gunter and Dr. Ahmed Teb actually offered a thorough examination of the drivers of the Iraqi dinar exchange rate. Their expert analysis highlighted the complex interplay of economic, political, and external factors that influence the currency's value. The discussion underscored the need for strategic economic reforms and diversification to enhance Iraq's economic resilience and ensure the stability of the dinar in the long term.